Former Prime Minister has had a lot of time on his hands uh, since he has been recovering from his stroke. But it's always good to see that he's still actively engaged and in this particular instance defending the country and the good people of Cuba. As you know, the former President of the United States, uh, Donald Trump, had put, a put Cuba on a blacklist uh, of terrorists, uh, calling them as terrorists. And so um, he was totally in order to write the new president of the United States calling for a, a call off of this embargo against Cuba. Um, it's, it's a long time coming. We're living now in a globalized day, globalized age, that there should not be this type of animosity between countries like America and Cuba.